Hi, this is Ivan with Simple Sheets. In this video, we're going to do a step-by-step -step tutorial of our cost of quality template. This is one of over 100 pre-built and smart templates that we offer. Click the link in the description and try 5 free templates before you buy. Let's get started. The introduction sheet contains a short description about this template. Over here, we have a customization difficulty, an explanation of the sheets that come with this template, and some instructions on how you can utilize this template. At the bottom, we have a short guide on using our templates with compatible online services. This template would allow you to see how much of your money goes into preventing products being sold that are of poor quality. By doing this, you could gain insights into what potential savings you could have from implementing process improvements. The only sheet you have to worry about really is the raw data sheet. You can expand the source list by pressing the plus sign on the left. Input the different items, as well as all the pertinent details concerning the material costs per item and hourly rates for the appraisal costs, internal costs, external costs, and prevention costs. You can collapse the tables when done. In the raw data table, input the date and fill up the columns with the yellow headings. Those are the failure type, issue, quantity, and task hours if applicable. You should get the item cost, material cost, hourly rate, hours cost, and amount automatically. Once you're done, you can move on to the master sheet. In the master sheet, we have reports for each type of cost and a rundown of the totals that you've logged in the raw data table. At the end of each table, you have the cost of quality percentage with an indicator color. Generally, the lower the better, and for higher values, you might want to take a look into them more because there might be process improvements that you can work on. On the right-hand side, you have some analysis tools to help you visualize your data. You have a bar chart which shows you your totals per cost type. You have a donut chart to give you the divisions from the totals of each type. And you have a line chart showing your cost trend over time. This template comes with slicers to help you better tailor your charts. Above, we have a timeline slicer so you can filter by date. Then we have slicers which allow you to filter based on failure type and issue. That's all for this template. If you want to automate your Excel processes and enhance your level of productivity, Simple Sheets Advanced Templates and University is the best tool out there. I'll see you guys on the next one.